I'm gonna go teleport into that shed in three, two, one. Oh, perfect. From the shed. Hey guys, I'm Adam here, and welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna try and get some pigeons again back at the barn and we're looking for some pigeons. So hopefully we're gonna get some pigeons. So hang around and we'll see how it goes. All right, let me explain that a little bit better. So let me explain what's going on. So it's kind of getting late in the day and it's rainy, it's not really nice. And I'm out there with Hunter Ryan trying to get a, make a video on a pigeon hunting vlog. But unfortunately, we don't get any pigeons. But that's not the end of the story. So we have about 40 minutes to get some pigeons and we're unsuccessful and so yeah. It just kind of turned out into a montage so if you want to skip to this timeline to see the update part of the video, go right ahead if you want. If you might be offended, don't watch this video. It is a hunting video so yeah, let's go right to it. So the gun we're using today is the Benjamin Trail Nitro Piston 2, very nice gun. Uh, and synthetic stock in .22 with some Crossman .22 hollow point pellets. If you guys can see that there. Good pellets. So we'll see if we can get anything. Fun fact guys, we actually use the Benjamin Trail Nitro Piston 2 to get the 150 yard uh, Air Gun Depot Long Rangers trick shot. So that was really cool. Um, and we got, the, we got the patches and stuff and we're hoping to do 175 yards uh, later on, hopefully. So our setup here, guys, is we're basically using this um, brake barrel and we're gonna put it on the sandbag here. And the sandbag basically pr uh, provides us um, consistent accuracy since we shoot the exact same way. So uh, I could use this uh, if I rest the gun up on it and we'll get consistent shots because you guys have to use the artillery hold when you use brake barrels. So it helps a lot when you use the, um, this bag and we're basically put right here. So yeah, we're shooting at the roof up on there, the pigeons will come in, land, and we try to shoot them on the trusses or on that board though. And it seems to work pretty well. So let's see what we can do. I'm gonna go teleport into that shed in three, two, one. Oh, perfect. From the shed. <laughs> I say you just go through it. Holy smokes, guys, look at the size of that spider. Alright guys, we are now in the shed that I was showing you guys before, so we'll see what we can do here. I mean, I'll show you guys. Oh, I almost fell. We are kind of just shooting out up onto that roof up there. Still waiting for some pigeons to arrive. So guys, it's 4.45 and we still haven't got anything yet and I have to leave in a bit, so we're gonna see if we can get anything, and if we can't, well, that'll be the hunting vlog. What is oh. that, like, three dots a hold over? I can barely see anything. Well, that was unsuccessful, so we're gonna go and move to a new location. Let's keep going. All right, so this video is really not working out for me, so we're just gonna shoot some water bottles now. And yeah, let's go. All right, first one is that 
15 yards. All right, this one's at 20 yards. 35 yards. Last water ball is at 50 yards. Here we go. Now guys, we're just gonna pop all these four bottles at about how many yards? 15. Going for the cap. Alright, so I hope you guys watched that hunting vlog at the beginning of the video. But now we're gonna switch over to the man cave. Let's go. Alright, so let me explain what's going on with the Hunter Tom channel. Well, more importantly, what's going on with the Hunter Tom studio. Alright, so what's new around here? Well, I've got some guns on the wall. Maybe not that cool, but yeah, it's it's coming along well, coming along well. Also, I've gotten rid of all the uh, shelving that was here before, so no more shelving, which is great, because now I can put better shelving. And hopefully, on this wall right here, I'm going to stick some of your pictures and of my pictures of hunts, and we're just I'm just going to print them out and hopefully just make a big wall of all the kills that Hunter Nation has got. Also, this wall here is new. It wasn't here before, and it's gonna be great for filming. Hey, right, well, officially my tripod is broken. No! Good thing I got a B&H magazine. Yeah, so I've, I've had the tripod for about like four years now, so I think it's five, four or five years now, and uh, I think it's time to get a new one, so yeah. So yeah, I, there's still a lot of work to be done in the studio, and it's, it's a work in progress, like I'm working quite hard to get this place nice, and yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna try and keep this place running and, you know, get it functioning to an extent. I mean, there's still a lot of stuff that's to be done down here to get it actually pretty functional and into a solid video working station. But I've got a heavy, heavy course load this school year. So I'm gonna do my best to keep the videos consistent, keep them good, and yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I know it was kind of quick, but uh, oh wait, I've, I've got to show you something. Quick, up, quick update on the BB machine gun. I've got the barrel for the BB mach machine gun. I'll shoot 4.5 millimeter steel BBs, and I've got a, I think it's about a 10 inch barrel. So we're gonna see how well it's gonna work. I mean, I still have to get a few pipes and stuff, but it's on its way. I'm hoping to finish it by the end of fall, maybe, depending how busy the school year is and, or how school goes, but this year's gonna be a very busy year for uh, my schoolwork, heavy course load, so. I'm gonna try to keep the videos consistent and good quality, but I have no promises on that. Um, I'll try to upload weekly as I usually do, but they might, some videos might lack quality and some might be good, some might be boring. I think this video probably isn't the best video, but I'd try to make it as good as possible. I mean, yeah. Um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and even though I didn't really shoot any animals, and I didn't give too much of an update, well, you know what's going on. I'm still alive, and, well, 
I'm trying to get this place nice and working. So anyway, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care and bye-bye.